If any of you have ever had an issue when trying to purchase or buy a manufactured home to get a retired title uh, for your manufactured home, today I went through that process. I just bought a manufactured home with cash, uh, and because I don't have a mortgage on it, it makes it really easy. Um, but if you had a mortgage on it, there's usually third-party services, and you have to pay an astronomical amount of uh, fees and work with a particular lender that's willing to allow you to perfect title at closing with a third-party service. Now, we at Loan Depot do that, but I wanted to show you, if you're a seller, how to do that by yourself right now. Uh, if you had a, a home that maybe is free and clear to perfect the title prior to closing in order to uh, allow more lenders to be able to finance the home, make it easier for the next person to buy the house. Um, usually, manufactured homes are a little more challenging to finance than a regular stick-built single-family residence. In the state of Florida, you want to go to your county recording office. That's usually where you get marriage licenses uh, recorded and whatnot to show that the manufactured home is being retired. And I've got my recorded deed here uh, and retirement of title. Uh, all now I got to do now is go through the DMV office here. I'm actually going through the drive-through to uh, put these registrations to uh, the land, so I don't have to continue to get these little tags like you'd get on a motor vehicle. Go to your property appraiser's office to get your manufactured home and property classified as real property. And after one more trip to the property appraiser's website and back to the DMV. I finally have my retired permanent tags. So now I have real property and now I have permanent tags and the title has been retired and that's how you do that.